You know, there are certain brands in our industry that have just such a rich history and pedigree within our space. And MB Quart certainly fits the bill when it comes to sound quality, because like you, I remember the days when they absolutely owned the championship lanes. But recently, they have found their calling. And I mean found their calling in Power Sports Audio. Today, we've got their product expert, Rob Anderson, in the studio with us, and we're going to break down for you exactly why MB Court is a heavyweight in the Power Sports Audio category. This is CMA Networks, presented by SiriusXM, all about MB Court Power Sports, and it starts now. Welcome, guys, to another CMA Networks presentation here. We're talking about Power Sports Audio, and more specifically, we're going deep on MB Quart Power Sports. Now, like I said, we've got Rob Anderson in the studio with us. Rob, this is going to be an exciting show. We know that the evolution of MB Quart into this space has been quite aggressive. Uh, we see you at the shows. We see the products you're coming up with. And more importantly, we see the platforms that you're providing solutions for. Can you give us a quick breakdown of what we're going to be covering today? Absolutely, Ben. So we're going to be going into a deep dive of all of our vehicle-specific stage kits for all of the market-leading uh, UTVs on the marketplace. We'll be talking over some universal solutions, and then maybe I'll give you guys a little teaser on what's to come. You know, Rob, I can always count on you to bring something unexpected to the table. So you've already, <laughs> you already got me all excited. Uh, we're going to have a jam-packed show for you guys today. We're talking um, Power Sports Audio Kits with Rob Anderson, MB Court. But before that, a quick word from our sponsor, SiriusXM, reminding you dealers out there why it is so advantageous to always be selling SiriusXM. And when we come back, MB Court, Power Sports Audio. Don't you dare go away. Hey guys, Ricky Lima here from SiriusXM. I had a chance to speak to some dealers and ask them what they love about selling SiriusXM. Here's what they had to say. Coast to coast coverage. I love SiriusXM for commercial free music. It's a great ad on sale and a profit opportunity. We love selling Sirius XM because you can listen to the same channel coast to coast. Profitability and ease of installation. It's a no brainer. We love selling Sirius XM for its ease of installation, great profitability and reliability. People love it. All right, welcome back. Well, let's get into it. MB Court. Power Sports Audio, if you didn't know, I mean, this brand has been really active and have applied themselves within this category. Uh, if you check out the website, you're going to see there's a huge selection that you probably might not be aware of. But I'll tell you what, a lot of guys, a lot of enthusiasts absolutely are. So, Rob, the first question out of the gate, what is this story behind MB Court's evolution towards being such a major player within Power Sports Audio? And why is it such a perfect time for dealers to take a closer look right now? Well, it's always a good time to be uh, working with MB Court, but let's talk about our history with power sports. First of all, we were probably one of the first people to ever put audio in a UTV man ages ago at CES when our now VP of product and marketing, Brian Sherman, built a Yamaha Rhino and was probably one of the first people to ever put audio in a now seems archaic uh, UTV. But let's talk about now the modern MB Court UTV. So we are the OEM supplier for Polaris, and that actually progressed to CF Moto. So we have this good foundation of engineering uh, teams collaborating with the OEM suppliers. So we know how these, syst uh, these systems and these vehicles are designed from the inside out, and we're taking that information we, we learned from the OEM side, and we're injecting it into the aftermarket side and all the products that we're gonna be talking about today. Rob, that is really interesting that you bring that up. I mean, certainly that application of MB Court within that OEM space as a provider, I can see definitely gives you an edge and probably explains a lot about what we're going to segue into next, which is the extensive line of application specific kits that MB Court actually has in their catalog right now. So why don't you break that down for us a little bit before we break it into pieces. The overall, what exactly is available for UTV enthusiasts right now? 
Well, Ben, let's talk about the overall design philosophy that we we integrate into these uh, vehicle specific kits. So the big thing with MB Court is that we're taking this information that we've learned through the OEMs and we're making sure that our aftermarket kits integrate perfectly with the electronic system. And so that makes it a plug and play solution. So that eliminates any guesswork out of the, the, the picture when you're getting these systems. So the uh, wiring is cut to length. Um, amp plates are perfectly designed so they drop in bolt in no problem templates are included so that kick panels could be perfectly drilled out into the uh, oem plastics and that towers um, are actually sized perfectly for either oem roll bars or aftermarket applications as well well you have me convinced rob now you got to tell me the goods what exactly are the applications for each kit that you currently have in your catalog well, all right, we have to start with the the typical, the, the bread and butter UTV, the Polaris Razor. This is the Apex chassis, and we have a full line of kits that's dedicated to just this, uh, this platform. So the cool thing about this is that our subwoofer box that's included in the stage three, stage five, and its independent self as just a subwoofer kit is a ported box design. So it's tuned at 42 hertz. It mounts behind the dash. That's one of our, 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 our big things that differentiates us from most of the kits on the market. But then a big thing that is also an additional feature that kind of sets us apart is that we use 8-inch compression horn drivers on the full Apex Razor chassis uh, kit. So that's eight inch kicks for the front and then eight inch compression horn rear pods for if you get the stage five option. Um, the nice thing is that we integrate uh, both amp brackets for the earlier model years and the late model years of that chassis. And everything, like I said, is plug and play. So if you have a two door model, the the wiring harness is cut to length for you. But then if you have a four passenger the four door we actually have an extension kit that's in there so it's plug and play extended out so no guessing on that end too the nice thing as well is that we cover two different source units with our packages um and this will be true with all the the polaris models but we'll, we'll talk about it in in depth with this uh razor chassis so we include for if you don't have an OEM uh, ride command unit, we actually have a kit that comes with our GMR LED source unit. So this source unit is an AM, FM, Bluetooth source unit with a video in, full color display, um, nice uh, integration with Apple product and Android products. So plug your phone in and have all the control at your fingertips via the source unit. So put the, the phone away nicely, store it away so that doesn't get damaged while you're writing. But then we also got the people covered with the ride command. So we have a ride command specific stage two, stage three, and stage five uh, kits available. So that includes an amplifier that's specifically designed to integrate with the ride command unit and a plug and play uh, adapter so that you plug right into the ride command unit and you have your preamps out for our system. Well, Rob, it certainly seems like you've covered off every angle when it comes to the ride command side of things. But what about all the other platforms available within the Polaris family? Absolutely. So Continue on with the ride command discussion that we had in the, the Polaris Razor. So we also have kits that cover the Polaris General and the Polaris Ranger, both from a ride command aspect. So like I said, stage two, stage three, and stage five options that fully integrate with that ride command unit. Or we have the standalone um, GMR LED packages. So if you don't have that uh, OEM source unit, we could provide one for you perfectly plug and play. But let's go into some specifics about the Polaris General Kit and the Polaris Ranger Kits that we have. So we have an amazing uh, package for the Polaris Ranger where it actually, the subwoofer is mounted in the, the rear or excuse me, the front passenger seat underneath it. It comes with this really great box design that has integrated storage compartments kind of built into it. So we we don't 
we know that you're sacrificing maybe some storage there with the subwoofer, so you want some amazing low end, but we're giving you some options so you still have some storage uh, for your tools or like riding gloves or stuff like that. But then um, let's talk about some specifics on the general side of things. So the general, we have some really cool um, pods that really integrate well with the dash so nice kick panels those are six and a half inch speakers our mp1 line of uh speakers so that's our nautic premium so six and a half inch polypropylene um, composite cone with a one inch titanium dome tweeter so the one thing about mb court is that we are always a speaker company first right so we're 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 injecting our heritage, our amazing tweeter designs, our amazing speaker design into this, into these kits, right? So with that Nautic Premium, whew, it sounds great, both in the Ranger and the General. Um, and for the Ranger side of things, and excuse me, and the General side of things, we have uh, the proper mounting brackets to give you rear cans with that OEM uh, ROP style cage. So everything's included in the box like i said no guessing but on this end it's it's fully integrated with those uh ride command units if need be or our standalone gmr led source unit all right so let me get this right rob we've got every possible you know option or scenario when it comes to the polaris platforms and we do know the polaris platforms are obviously very popular but don't tell me you left out those can-am and honda guys did you Oh, heck no, man. You, you, I mean, come on. If you mention a Polaris Razor, you absolutely need to follow that up with a Can Am X3, right? So we absolutely have solutions both for Can Am X3 and the Honda Talon. But let's go in some depth with uh, some of this stuff, uh, including both kits. So again, like the, the Polaris options, here on the Can Am and the Honda side of things, we have a full line of SKUs that, that offer different kind of... Um, configurations within the application, right? So a stage five that gives you two front speakers, two rear can uh, pod speakers, um, two amplifiers that are included in the kit to power both those um, speakers and the subwoofer that's included. Um, that's our NA2 Nautic Premium uh, amplifier line where that's integrated and, and built in to this kit so that it, it's plug and play. and it's an amplifier that is proven. We've we've designed it to be able to take the withstand the the brutal force of these machines that are going to be putting it through. Um, from the Can Am side, let's go more in depth about like maybe the front speaker setup. So the cool thing about the the front speaker setup is that we actually fully replace the front dash panels on the A pillar side and. Um, so you get a six and a half inch Nautic Premium, just like in the, the Polaris options, but then this beautiful textured ma matched um, panel replaces that OEM panel. And I'm gonna, it's, it's a little bit better fitting than the OEM panel because that's what our engineers do, right? We're, we're not content with just making a replacement panel. It needs to be at least OEM quality, if not better. And in this case, we definitely provided a better quality panel than you're getting an OEM. The fit and finish is amazing. Um, I, I know people can attest to this that have seen the panel because it's some of the gaps that you get from the OEM. It's kind of like, whoa, you, I can't believe you got away with that. We're fixing that with this uh, uh, kit, which is kind of cool. Um, on the X3 side, again, let's talk about another big uh, benefit of our kits. So if you get a stage two or stage three kit um, and a stage five, you have this uh, wiring harness that actually allows you to expand upon it. So in the stage three and stage five kits, we include an under the seat subwoofer and well, that's great if you put it underneath the driver's seat. Well, there's some, there's a passenger seat right there. Why, what if we wanted to add an additional sub into the system? Well, we had that in mind when we designed this. So already integrated into the wiring harness that you're gonna get on these stage two, stage three, stage fives is an additional plug and play input for an additional sub. So you could run two sub setup without cutting a single wire. 
um, which is pretty amazing. And with that additional uh, subwoofer kit, we actually have another add-on amp, amp bracket, so it's an easy tie-in to the installation. Um, from the Honda Talon side, Honda Talon, right? Everyone knows, one, it's a Honda. They're built amazing. The quality uh, that you get from the machine is amazing. But let's talk about how we improve the audio. So if you've been in one of the vehicles and your customers have been in one of the vehicles, or if you're a consumer, if you have one of these vehicles, you know how tight the, the um, interior is on this. So we came up with a couple awesome solutions for this. So one, we have our integrated amplifier brackets that make it super easy to, to install the amplifiers within the, the unit itself. But then our low profile sub box integrates perfectly into the interior so that you're not sacrificing any rear storage and you're still getting some low end out of the system from the stage three, stage five, and the additional, if you add on, just bought a sub kit by itself. Um, but same thing that's included in all the other models uh, that we talked about before. So we have our Nautic premium speakers, our NA2 Nautic amplifiers, and then an amazing plug and play easy solution from the install side of things. I got to give it to you, Rob, the amount of detail and innovation that I can is evident in your designs and the solutions that you have for so many different platforms. I mean, it's hard to deny. But power sports encompasses a lot even beyond just those popular platforms, whether it's a golf cart or, you know, or uh, any other vehicle, really, that you want to get some sound on. Can MB Court help with this for any perhaps universal applications? We definitely have uh, a universal solution for multiple different platforms. So one of our products that is perfect, say for like a golf cart application, is our universal overhead sound systems. So the nice thing about this is that it's a whole kind of jump starter sound system in one kind of all-in-one system. So you get a source unit, you get power, and you get speakers, and then maybe a few other options as well. Let's go in depth with that. So first, let's talk about the source unit. Um, the source unit that we've selected for the overhead sound bars is our GMR LCD. Um, it's an amazing uh, source unit that has AM, FM, Bluetooth, a great USB input. So for iPhone, um, wired wi iPhone or Android, we have you covered. Um, and it's fully waterproof, IPX67, so dustproof, mudproof. If you're taking it around, say you get some, I don't know, I guess from a golf cart, you were not going to get probably dirt unless you're doing something crazy on the golf course. But um, if it's dirty, hose it down. Don't have to worry about messing it up. It's full IPX67. Um, let's move on to the power. So we have integrated a 160-watt amplifier that's going to be powering four six-and-a-half-inch uh, coaxial speakers that's in this unit. So the six and a half inch coaxial speakers, um, it is a three quarter inch titanium dome tweeter and our polypropylene uh, composite cone um, mid bases that is going to be kind of, or not mid base, but um, cones that are going to be integrated with that. And, it, and a pretty slick looking um, solution from a product standpoint. So it's not just a box that you slap up in there. It's a good looking piece and a little creature comfort because it's an overhead soundbar. We have an integrated um, dome light. So perfect for a golf cart or even some uh, UTV applications. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, Rob, but when it comes to power sports enthusiasts or UTV enthusiasts, there is a deep culture, a lifestyle that comes with this, whether it's mud or it's dirt. What is MB Court doing to integrate themselves into this culture and support this whole movement of power sports in general? So the one thing here about MB Court, and the one thing you'll actually hear me preach a lot if you see me at the shows, is that we're not just a company that's trying just to sell you product. Um, the people that work here, the employees, the from the higher ups down to the warehouse staff, we're all enthusiasts. So Brian, like I mentioned, VP of product in uh, marketing, he, man, he's always building some UTVs, some crazy UTVs. I think he's got a KRX right now, and it, man, the thing's 
awesome. Um, me, from my standpoint, power sports, you know, I've done racing, I've done um, overland, I'm like, man, I just built a sweet cross track. I know it's not UTV specific, but like we live and breathe this stuff. We're not someone that's just, all right, let's design a product. Let's make something. Hopefully people will be into it. We live and breathe this. So when we're designing product, we're actually torture testing on our own personal rides. We're beating the crap out of them and making sure that it's designed to the point where on your end, on the consumer's end, that it's going to be perfect solution and it's going to be torture tested properly so it could survive in these harsh conditions. Um, another big thing is that we actually support the community. So anything from Camp Razor out in Glamis or uh, the Sand Sports Super Show out in California or even go to Bridgestone. Um, um, Brimstone and out in the East Coast, we are out there with you guys. One, sponsoring rides, riding with you, and making sure that these events that y'all have fun with, we're we're there supporting those events so that you guys can come to them and have a great time. Well, we've gone through the entire journey now. We've talked about all the application specific kits. We've talked about universal solutions. And we've talked about how MB Court is using their heritage and pedigree and sound quality and speaker design and influencing UTV enthusiasts and being part of the culture, being part of that lifestyle. Sum it up for us, Rob. Dealers tuning in, why do they need to call you right now to become the next MB Court Power Sports Audio dealer? From a dealer side of things, you have to think about what the consumer's thinking, right? Well, they know the name MB Court because we have these OEM relationships. So right away, we have brand recognition and they, they're going to be familiar with our brand. So one, we know that. Two, we know that we have the technology and the the engineering that's gone in with these OEMs. So you're not gonna be getting a product that is uh, kind of just thrown together. Everything has been engineered, designed with sound quality and ease of installation in mind. Um, not to mention that we have a full product category and offering that covers all the applications that you're gonna be asked about, that people are gonna be bringing to your shop. And then if, the, for some reason, if they don't have the market leading UTVs, we have universal solutions that have you covered. And not to mention, little teaser for y'all, we're gonna be having a full aftermarket roof line that's gonna be launching this fall. So you definitely wanna become a dealer now because you're gonna to wanna to be the first ones to have those new uh, roofs aftermarket wise in your shop. And that's a wrap on this special episode all about Power Sports Audio featuring MB Quart products. I want to give a shout out to my man, Rob Anderson, for coming in to the studio with us today. And did you hear that little, little Easter egg he dropped at the end? I know you did. So definitely pay attention to that, uh, according to Rob, coming in a little later this fall. If you want more information on MB Quart products, you're going to want to check out their website, mbquart.com. If you're a dealer, you're a consumer, give them a call, connect with them. They will certainly connect you and point you in the right direction. On that note, this is another CMA Networks production brought to you by SiriusXM. Thanks for watching. I'm your host, Ben Wu. Until next time, we connect. There's never been a better time to have Sirius XM with over 150 channels in your vehicle. Your Platinum Plan offer includes more than ever before to enjoy online, on your phone, or at home. Create your own ad-free personalized stations powered by Pandora. Hear ad-free extra channels and enjoy favorite shows with Sirius XM video on demand. What you love is on now.